Now the next topic is collinear point. Now we will drive a condition. How can we check whether the given points are collinear or not? Let point A with position vector A, point B with position vector B, and point C with position vector C be distinct points. in r cube space if a b c are collinear if and only if c point lie on a b line that is vector equation of two line is satisfied by the point c that is that implies vector c is equal to a times passing through point a k times in the direction of a b that is position vector of a p that gives c minus a is equal to k times b minus a so we check out what happened if we get the cross product of difference of C minus A into B minus A. So substitute the value of C minus A is K times B minus A into that is cross product not simple into B minus A. And cross product of two similar vector is 0 because angle between them is 0 that is sin 0 is 0 so it is k into 0 that gives 0 so this is the condition if we have to check c vectors are collinear or not therefore a b c are collinear if and only if vector c minus a into it is cross product Vector V minus A is equal to 0 vector or we can say 0. So this is a condition to check out whether the points are collinear or not. Now we will do a problem. How can we check the points are collinear? So prove that point minus 1, 2, 5. The second point minus 2, 4, 2. And the point 1 minus 2 11 that the three points are collinear that is lie on a line. So as we done in the theorem and on the in the article to check for the IT of the three points, we have to mention the vector as A that is minus 1 to 5, the vector B that is minus 2, 4, 2 and vector C that is 1, minus 2 and 11. Now we have to find C minus A that is 1, C minus A is 1, minus of minus 1 is 2, minus 2, minus 2, minus 4, 11 minus 5 is 6 and component of B minus A is minus 2 plus 1 is minus 1, 4 minus 2 is 2, 2 minus 5 is minus 3. Now we have to check whether the points are collinear or not. So we will use the condition that is C minus A cross product B minus A. That can be find out by that is minus 4, 6, 2, minus 3. 6, 2, minus 3, minus 1, and 2, minus 4, minus 1, 2. So we get that is minus 12, minus 4, minus 3, plus 12, minus 12. 6 into minus 1 is minus 6, minus 3 into 2 is minus 6, and in between minus that is plus 6. So 2 into 2 is 4, 4 minus, minus 4 minus 1 is 4. So we get 
zero comma zero comma zero. That is zero vector. So this is a sufficient condition to check out whether the points are collinear or not. Therefore, given points are collinear. No need to check scalar triple product of vector as we done in the earlier topic. If scalar triple product is zero, this is not the instruction condition. We have to check again this. It may be zero. It may not may not be zero. So this is the main condition. It is sufficient necessary condition to check out whether the given points are collinear or not. Now we are going to stick and prove a theorem, which is based on condition of collinearity, that the whether the points are collinear or not. What is the sufficient necessary condition to prove or to judge the points are collinear or not? The theorem. Seven point one. That is, if A, B, and C are three distinct. Points in space. Then a necessary and sufficient condition for a, b, c. To be collinear is that there exists non-zero real number L M N such that. L plus M plus N is equal to zero, and L times vector A, M times vector B, plus N times vector C is equal to zero. Now the proof of the theorem is. As we know that c minus a into p minus a is equal to zero is a sufficient condition for. A, B, C to be collinear. Now, we will obtain a necessary condition. For C points to be collinear as A, B, C are collinear if and only if that is. That is C minus A cos product with B minus A is equal to zero. So we will open it. That is 
first of all c into b minus c into a now the turn of a minus a into b plus a into sorry a cross a zero not right learn it uh, read it as into read it as cross so as we know that cross product of two same vector is zero therefore cross cross product of vector a cross a is zero so we get vector c cross b minus cross product of vector a and c and cross product of vector a and b is equal to zero now to make minus common out we will uh, change vector uh, cross product of c cross b as minus cross product of b cross c as we know that cross product is not commutative remaining terms are same now minus is cancel out from these terms that is why taken common out so we get b cross c plus c cross a plus a cross product Now we take the dot product with each term. That is on both sides also zero into dot product something or some value that is zero. So we take b cross product c dot product c plus c cross product a dot product c plus a cross product b dot product c is equal to zero. So that gives if we see that is a scalar triple product scalar triple product will be zero if two vectors are same so scalar triple product of this is zero and scalar triple product of this is zero therefore we get a cross product with b dot product with c is equal to zero that is scalar triple product of vector a b and c is zero so this is a which is a necessary condition not a sufficient condition Now to understand this, we will take an example. For example, consider A with component 1, 2, 0, B with component minus 4, 1, 9 and C with component 2, 4, 0. So let vector A is 1, 2, 0, vector B is minus 4, 1, 9 and vector C is 2, 4, 0. Now we will check out its scalar triple product that is scalar triple product of C vector is determined by by taking the determinant of C vector that is 1, 2, 0, first row minus 4, 1, 9, second row 2, 4, 0, third row now expanding it by first row we get 1 1 into 0 is 0 minus 36 so minus 2 minus 4 into 0 is 0 minus 9 into 2, 80 plus 0 that is minus 16 minus 2. So we get minus 36 plus 36 and 0 into something is 0. So we get 0. So according to given conditions, points should be collinear. But we said this is not the necessary condition, is not sufficient. So also we check out cross product of vector C minus A and 
वेक्टर b माइनस ए तो कंपोनेंट ऑफ c माइनस ए विल बी टू माइनस वन डेट इज वन फोर माइनस टू डेट इज टू जीरो माइनस जीरो इज जीरो क्रॉस प्रोडक्ट b माइनस ए इज डेट इज वन माइनस माइनस डेट इज b माइनस ए That will be minus four minus one minus five. One two minus sorry one minus two is minus one and that is a zero and uh, b b is nine minus zero is nine. The difference of two vectors. So we have to get the cross product of this. We know the method. So it becomes two zero minus one nine comma Zero one nine minus five comma one two minus five minus one. So we get eighteen minus one into zero is zero. That is eighteen. Zero into minus five is zero. That is minus nine. And minus one into plus ten is plus nine. Which is not equal to zero, then this condition is not satisfied. Therefore, A, B, C are non-collinear as even scalar triple product of C vector is zero. So this is not the necessary condition. Therefore, c minus a cross product with b minus a is equal to zero is a sufficient condition to check the collinearity. Of three point A, B, and C. So this is a theorem regarding the polarity of three points.